Alright guys, today we're going to be doing a review of this Logitech Z323. This is actually going to be the first video I'm recording with my new iPod Touch. Um, so this is a pretty nice sound system. I did an unboxing video of it, which was the video... Oh, that's what that reflection was. It's confusing me. Uh, anyway, there was a video when I did an unboxing of it. It was a pretty crappy unboxing, but you know what? I don't care. So first, let's take a look at these little satellites here. Um, if you look, they're really glossy. They're scuffed up. Or not scuffed, but they're all fingerprinted. They're ported. They've got, it looks like little one-inch drivers, or maybe one and a half. Then on the back... We've got another driver, because these are Logitech 360 degree sound speakers. And uh, what that means is, if you look right there, you can see that it says audio is projected evenly in all directions, so you get a great listening experience throughout the room. And there's their little 360 degree logo. I'm using the light on it, on this iPod, because it'll, it'll just make the video nicer. You got two of them, it's a 2.1 system, and the subwoofer here, uh, I don't know what size, I don't know what size to call this, um, I, I'm gonna go ahead and say it's a 3 inch diameter, maybe 3 inch, maybe 4 inch, I don't know, but it's a good, it's a pretty loud little subwoofer, um, it's not, it doesn't, um, put out nearly as much bass as, the one down there does, but that's a 6 inch and this is a 3 inch, or 4 inch, or whatever we're going to decide. I'm going to say it's a 3 inch. Um, you got your connections on the back of the subwoofer. As you would pretty much expect with any sound system today, you got the bass control. I almost bought the Z320, or 313. Um, I didn't for two reasons. One, this was $60. That's how much the Z313 was before. And also, the Z313 doesn't have 360 degree sound. There's that on both speakers. Oops. Yeah. Um. Anyway, bass control, you got that here. All the way up. Left speaker, right speaker, and there's also an aux input. Although that's... Come on. There we go. That I feel like that should be the main input because it's RCA. If you're hooking it up to a TV, uh, it should be the main input. This one here, the 3.5 millimeter, should be like it's it's going to be the one that you're going to use if you're plugging it into like an iPhone or something. Then on the side here, and this is not focusing. Come on, there we go. You've got it looks like another input and a headphone port. So I'm going to plug my iPod into this and I'm going to have to switch back to using my freaking Canon camera. Here, you know what? I'll show you. Uh, there it is. It's on my floor. I'm doing this. I have to use this one to record this part of the video. It's the one I used for pretty much all of my videos before this one. So yeah, I'm going to go get that hooked up right now. Alright, we're back on the Canon camera. There it is. Here's my red 5th generation Apple iPod Touch. 64 gigabyte. We're going to play my music so I don't get freaking YouTube's copyright claims. It's always driving me crazy. Let's turn the sound on. All the way up. We're going to actually make sure this isn't very loud. Alright, we're going to play... Uh, let's play running. And that's halfway up on the iPod Touch. Untitled track.
that's basically it. I should probably turn that off. Um, that's basically it for that. Um, I guess I can play some uncopywritten dub stuff. Let's play... Uh, we'll do Beatwise. It's a good song. So that's basically it for this part of the video. I'm going to switch back to the camera on this thing. Alright, and we're back on the iPod camera. And I put more fingerprints on this thing while making that part of the video. Forgot to tell you that the subwoofer box is made of wood. If you look back there, oh wait, I don't even know if you can tell that it's wood just from looking at that, but it is made of wood, not plastic. Uh, high quality speakers. Um, it looks like they're pretty, uh, they're built pretty tough. The subwoofer is ported, obviously. So are the satellites. And I can't really think of anything else to say, other than that Logitech is a very good brand. Uh, I have their X530 and Z130. There's one of the speakers for both of those systems over there, and an Apple sticker, of course. Oh, wait, I forgot, I forgot, I forgot about this. I can zoom now. Oh, yes. Uh, refocusing is no longer going to be a problem because I can just literally go in, tap the screen, and it focuses. Anyway, that's going to be it for the video, guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you want more speaker reviews, I can go pick up another sound system. And I'm pretty sure I'll find a use for it somewhere around the house. And um, also, I don't know if you can tell, but the speaker is, the subwoofer is downfiring. Um, and yeah, anyway, that's it for the video, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. And I, yeah, that, that's, that's just it. Bye.